Ron DeSantis, you've been a great governor, but with all three of my other colleagues on this debate stage, is all three of them have been licking Donald Trump's boots for years for money and endorsements. <laughs> Ron DeSantis, you've been a great governor, but you would have never been one without actually begging Donald Trump for that endorsement. And you attacked him in your Nikki book Haley. a year ago. Same thing with Chris Christie as a lobbyist, begging them for COVID money for his special interests in New Jersey, prepping him for the debates last time around. These people are now Monday morning quarterbacking some decision he made. I think the real enemy is not Donald Trump. It's not even Joe Biden. It is the deep state that at least Donald Trump attempted to take on. And if you want somebody who's going to speak truth to power, then vote for somebody who's going to speak the truth to you. Why am I the only person on the stage, at least, who can say that January 6th now does look like it was an inside job? That the government lied to us for 20 years about Saudi Arabia's involvement in 9-11? That the great replacement theory is not some grand right-wing conspiracy theory? but a basic statement of the Democratic Party's platform. That the 2020 election was indeed stolen by big tech. That the 2016 election, the one that Trump won for sure, was also one that was stolen from him by the national security establishment <coughs> okay. that actually Thank put up the Trump-Russia collusion hoax that they knew was false. There's a reason why I'm the only person That'll on the it, stage sir. who can Thank say you. these things. That's what it's going to take, not people who are licking his boots one time and now Monday okay. morning quarterbacking and criticizing <laughs> when it's convenient. Governor